Well, here we are, five minutes into it, our first fish of the year. What are we, Thursday evening, about 6, 6.30 on Matahina. Dan has hooked the first fish. And Dave forgot the net. It's not your fault this time, Dan, it's mine. First fish of the season. First fish of the season, got to forget something. And now that we know they're rising, oh, now that we know they're rising a little bit, they're now, rising, I just yeah, well now you can start rise. fishing more aggressively. Now I'm just going to float the boat and you fish. You strip, 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 fish, strip, stay in touch with it. And use your rod tip before you cast again as it, to make it move. Up, 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 now roll and go. So you can let it sink a little bit before you start, but then when you, you know, you give it a couple of wiggles. That's where I saw him rise. Well, it doesn't mean he's there anymore. These no. fish move, bro. I did get a bite back there on that. I know you did. I know you did, but they don't come back for a second bite usually. So bottom line is, the way we do this fishing, if they're not actively rising or attacking we fish it slower right in good spots but if we know they're up near the surface looking and feeding and you're seeing the you're seeing the rises you, yeah you can just fish it as fast as hell bottom line if they're not on the surface feeding you sort of have to get down to them a little bit so they can see that fly your distance already. born fly caster you are <laughs> that light is annoying. well I just cast it and it went fine Telling you anymore. Told, told, you, told you too many times. Nice stick you got there, bro. It gives me a chance to have a cast while you're mucking around. Oh, yeah! <laughs> I missed him again. Ah, <laughs> what a dick, eh? David. <laughs> That's about the fourth fish I've missed. Why did he come up and hammer that thing? It always pays to fish your feet first, right? Yep. 
He just came up and smashed it. Totally missed it. Damn it. Come up right at my feet again. Jesus, he's right here. Don't go backwards. Don't make noise. Jesus, Dan. Don't do anything. Just don't do anything. We ate it. He ate it. He came up and ate it. Oh. I got him. Holy crap, that was funny. All right, we're going to take this one, David. I got to catch him first, bro. He's just skinny little brown. Oh, is that the big one? Oh, I think it was the same. I think it was the same one that came up. I'm pretty sure it was. I didn't say he was big. It was just cool that he smashed it. That well, was awesome. Well, he's not terribly small or anything, but I finally hooked up though. After like, it's probably my fifth bloody take. Yeah, just push us, push us out, push. That'll do. That'll do. Yay. Yay. Well, if you want them, you can have them. Well, we might as well start keeping some, eh? Well, without a net, it's going to be a slight challenge. Daniel, would you like to inspect this fish? Evening is upon us, eh? Yep. Make our way down this edge for the right hander, and then we'll come back for the lefty. Ooh, fish. Ooh, fish, attacking, attacking. Ooh, there he is, got him. He missed it twice. Yeah, baby. Ooh, Ooh we got a runner. Ooh, Jesus. Ooh. Not a bad wee fish, Daniel. I don't think he was that big. I don't think he's huge or anything. Well, Matahina is looking good. And it's looking good. And that is a catch. Oh, I touched him. Dan's turn now. Give a strike. Definitely a fish that time. Yeah, he would have felt you on that one. 
Hook, hook, hook. You're on. Nice one. I saw the big swirl come up to your fly. That's good fish too. All right, Daniel does it. Now the cool thing is you get to grab your own fish. This is going to be fun. <laughs> Ooh, nice brownie. Now, yeah, yeah, pretty much I got to take your time. Oh, that's good brownie. Depends when he wants to start fighting, before or after you get him in your hand. Again, Daniel, you be a sweetheart and just, Daniel, you be a sweetheart and just move us forward. Oh, hold Dan, one cast, that's all I need. <laughs> Your turn again. <laughs> uh, crack up, crack up, crack up. Matahina's on, baby. Yeah, it's back, isn't it? Daniel's turn again. I think it's your turn till we get back because I've caught three fish. I'm quite happy. It's good to put a rod back in my hands though after, you know, six yeah. six plus months. Oh, yeah. Oh, since April or something. So yeah, that's definitely. May, June, July, August, September, October, November, December. It's almost eight months since I've gone fly fishing. Because it's December now. Because, well, remember we had duck season and then yeah. And then turkeys and then peacocks and all the pheasants I processed this year. Yeah, well the pheasants came a bit sooner as well. There were a lot of them. They were thick and fast all season. So it's good to be back on the water. Yep, and I saw oh, I saw your line tighten up way before you tried to hook. Did you break him off? Um, he's off. No, I think oh, you still got your fly. All right. I don't think he's coming back for that. No, I've 